Hi, everybody, again. Are you ready for tonight? Yes. Yeah. Did you have a good day? I yes. hope you did. Yeah, maybe you had not such a great day. So I have a question for you today, though. How full is your bucket? Your bucket? You say, but I don't have a bucket. I don't have a bucket. <laughs> <laughs> We have a book at our house called How Full Is Your Bucket? And I like what it talks about because it talks about how we all have an invisible bucket. Pretend an invisible bucket over our heads. And when we're having a great day and things are going really well, that bucket can be nice and full. And then we can pour out of that bucket to others. But sometimes when you're having not such a great day and maybe things have not gone so well, you're having a hard time, you can feel kind of sad. That bucket can feel kind of, what is it? Empty. It feels kind of empty, yeah. If people don't say good words to you. Yeah, maybe people have not been kind. And you know what? We want to make sure we keep our buckets nice and full because when our bucket is full, then we can pour out love and kindness to others, right? But where do we go to fill up our bucket? This is a good question. Let me read in the Bible. This is in Romans chapter 15, verse 13, and it says, Now, may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Did you hear that? May the God of hope fill you up. Did you know that God can fill your bucket? No. Yeah, God can fill up your bucket with hope and peace and joy and all the things that we need. You know, others can help to fill up our bucket. Yeah. Yeah, but... Everyone can help us fill up my bucket too. Yeah, but you know what? We can first go to God and he can help us fill it up. That's what he says. He has enough for us. Have you ever been to Niagara Falls or a big waterfall? Yes, you have. You have. I have, yeah. And you know what? Niagara Falls is so huge and the water is just rushing over the edge of the Niagara Falls. Can you imagine filling up this bucket from Niagara Falls? Can you imagine standing under Niagara Falls trying to fill up this little bucket? Oh my goodness, it would just go rushing right in so fast and it would start to bloop overflow. You wouldn't be able to hold all the water of Niagara Falls in there. You know what? God's love for us is like Niagara Falls. It is so amazing and powerful and it never runs out. And so tonight I pray that you would experience God's love and that it would fill up your bucket. Okay, so ready to pray? Okay, let's pray together. Repeat after me. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. That you never run out. That you never run out. Of hope. Of hope. Peace and joy. Peace and joy. Fill up my bucket. Fill up my bucket. Yes. Amen. 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 All right. Well, good night. I hope you have a good sleep.